Hi, how you doing? Justin here. Today I'm going to be answering the question, what is this strange thing I've got on the end of my guitar headstock? Lots of people have been asking about this in the comments for some time, so I thought I'd do a quick video and explain what it is. It's basically, it's muting the strings between the nut and the tuning pegs, because I can hear them on some guitars. Not all guitars, but this one particularly. Um, so look, if I just take it off, um, I'm sure you're aware that there's, um, that you can hear um, this little sound here and it, and it comes through through the actual guitar if I play like a G chord and then strum you can, you can hear it kind of comes through and what I was finding is there were certain things that I was playing blues licks or whatever uh, where if I or funk where I, if I hit the strings really hard on this side I could I can hear it it's very very quiet and I'm not even really sure it's getting picked up by the pickup but it was, I could hear it ringing out here and it was really annoying me. Um, I noticed that particularly on my mate and the mate and uh, Michael Fix model, it's got a, you can really hear it ringing out when you're playing acoustically and I was finding it a bit annoying. So um, that's what this is for. Now this particular one is called a Grove Gear Fret Wrap. Okay, um, I've seen lots of people use those like fluffy hair bands um, and I, I used to use one of those many, many years ago. Um, but seeing as they've made one, because they're always a bit awkward to stretch over the headstock. So now they've got this nice little uh, uh, thing, you know, it's just a bit of Velcro on the back. It's a lot easier to use. And it's just all of those strings, you know, the strings between the nut and the tuning pegs is now muted. So I don't have uh, that problem at all. So the other thing that these neck mutes are really good for is uh, muting all of the strings if you're going to do any two-handed tapping sort of a stuff. Um, you know, I've used a sock before now when for recording with doing stuff like this, but it just, if you bring it forward, the, the strings are all muted. So it can, you know, I've, I've seen guitar players use it as a, um, a way of hiding sloppy picking, uh, which it, it kind of works for as well. If you've really got a problem with strings ringing out and you can't get your technique together to mute the strings, which I really would suggest that you worked on yourself. But if you really can't deal with it, then a little wrap like this you might find uh, very helpful as well. Um, it's great for the, for the uh, two-handed tapping things. Um, I don't do it very well, but I have played before the, the Joe Satriani, a couple of his things actually, but stuff like... Uh, is it called Midnight or Day at the Beach? Midnight, I think it is, um, where, you can, where you're playing little bass notes with this hand, a melody with this hand. If I take the, the, the rap off, the notes don't come out anywhere near as clearly as they do now. So have a little go at it, see if I can kind of knock out the first part. Um. Anyway, that kind of thing. Played that for my college exam when I was a little tucker. Anyway, um, doing for those kind of eight, you know, finger tapping, they call it, um, or any of that sort of stuff is is definitely uh, clean upable with that. And I've, I've seen guys who play a lot more technical stuff than me flick it forward to do some fancy stuff and then knock it back again when they go back to playing regular riffs where they don't need that uh, kind of uh, string protection. But that's what, that's what it's all about. You know, I've never used it on like that on my acoustic guitar. I've never, I don't do any of that sort of tappy stuff on the acoustic guitar, but um, definitely on electric guitar, if you can hear those strings ringing out, and it's one of those things, if you don't hear it, you don't, I wouldn't, I wouldn't get one just because you've seen somebody else with one or whatever. You know, it's 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 there to cure a specific issue uh, of hearing those those notes ring out, and it doesn't happen on every guitar. But if it does happen, I get one of these uh, little wraps, um, and I think they work great. And you know, they don't seem to get in the way of my hand or anything. I can leave it there all the time, and it it doesn't uh, get awkward at all. So uh, might be worth checking out if you have that problem. So, well, I hope that answers that question for you. If you had that question, of of course. Um, I'll leave a link in the description of some places where you might want to buy yourself a uh, fret wrap there. Uh, please subscribe to my YouTube channel if you dig what I do. Remember, there's over a thousand free lessons now over on the website. That's justinguitar.com if you didn't know that already. And I'll see you for plenty more very soon. Take care of yourselves. Bye-bye.